Good afternoon, everybody. Um, welcome to my channel. I just made a, a, a short clip and I put it onto YouTube and this silly idiot, uh, um, what's his name? Jesus is Lord. I always forget his fucking name. But I um, made a comment out of it, but it shows his naivety, uh, his naive, because he has, hasn't seen the video properly or he didn't get the fucking message. Not surprised with Christian because they're fucking thick, right? So anyway, the nature of this video is because um, I saw a clip uh, given that it was given to me by um, Darth Talking the Bank. So thank you for him. Um, and Darth Talking was talking to Floyd FP, and to be to be, I mean, I respect the guy, but he was in error in a couple of places. That's why I was forced to make a video of this guy, uh, Michael um, Fraser, Hazer, something like that. Yeah, uh, to give a little bit of background. So let's go to the conversation that um, Daft Talking had with um, Floyd X, um, FP. Yeah. Um, things like abstract objects and um, even. By the way, uh, the audio and the clip is raw. As is, minus uh, uh, Gary Mill and his baggy. <laughs> Concrete objects and so forth. Um, so there are these kind of people. <clears throat> so Floyd, are you here? Uh, remember, this is not up talking. Somebody asking for Floyd. Come here. I, I, I think I need to turn up your your volume. I, can, I can't hear you that well. Okay. So, what do you think about what is nature of God? What do you think of the na uh, nature of God? Well, I mean. You have to define. That's his mistake. That's his mistake. You have to define it. Bullshit. You don't have to define it. You have to prove that the guy, the guy exists. And if exists, then he or she or it will show its own definition. A human being doesn't need to know the definition. But because you, uh, Floyd said to this guy, oh, well, you have to define it. Then uh, you are into the religious world. Which Darth Talkie is gonna take, uh, gonna get a uh, hold of him. God first, which would be his nature. What do you mean? He's, you see, his nature. Fuck his nature. Prove that exists before you can say that his nature is X Y Z. Then you can ask me what do I think about that particular God. Right? See, when you when you concede that a possibility of a God uh, uh, attributes, I said it's game over for you. Because you are going into their yard, and it's their rules. Yeah, if, you, if, yeah, if you ask me about a specific God, like like the God of Christianity, I, I would I would deny that that God exists. Well, you don't need to deny it. Yeah, you don't have to affirm the negative, right? Don't say you deny it because then you have to prove that it doesn't exist, right? You you are playing into Darth Talking's uh, script area. Right, it is far easier to say, "Can you please provide evidence of its existence?" Right, rather than you saying, "Oh, uh, nah, it, it, you're already in trouble." On on what grounds? You see, now this idiot jumps jumps in again. On the on the way, uh, he's def he's defined, in in my experience of, of of the world. Um, well. Since the God of the Bible would be a universal absolute in order to falsify the Christian. That's bullshit. That's mumbo jumbo. That's word salad. He doesn't know that. He's just making his own fucking God. He's actually defining it into existence. And I made a video of that. Yeah. So I'm not going to touch over it. I'm, we're just going to listen to this idiot defining his own uh, imaginary friend. So basically anything that comes out of your mouth is, is a beer. God, you'd have to 
instantiate a universal absolute that bullshit that's a claim negate the christian god can you do that see you have to negate it right and because lloyd sorry floyd already admitted that uh, he does not believe it right or it does not exist he's fucked i don't see why that's necessary um in order to negate a you would have to instantiate not a so uh wait the that definition is correct right but the problem is not the a the problem is what you categorize as a and then not a because if you say uh, um a my magic uh tension release uh um basketball right this will be a right it's up to you to say i haven't got a, a not a right but if you replace this uh, this a right with a god with, with with a fictional character that you cannot substantiate cannot prove okay you cannot give evidence empirical evidence or anything like that you cannot prove the not a because you have not made the a uh, um a, a quantifiable thing it is nothing it's empty it's vacuous vacuous since god is a universal absolute or ultimate the god of the bible that is <laughs> and the god of the bible i've made another video about that right the god of the bible uh, upon the uh, just following along right the god of the bible at the beginning he did not have any uh any attributes uh sorry any denomination it wasn't a jewish god it was just a non-denomination god right only when fucking abraham came into the picture he became a jewish god right and then in the right in the in the age of uh fucking what's his name uh paul that uh fictional character right that's when when uh the christus side of it came along the messiah the king of the jews right that's when it was uh the god of the bible the christian god he's talking about the christian god right that doesn't fucking you, you cannot prove that that exists because paul made that shit up you would have to establish that what is ultimate and absolute and it see he's 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 bored of uh, uh preaching his fucking script the concrete universal that is not god in order to show that that god that's a community college like just fucking mumbo jumbo the bible doesn't exist a, a not a what do you mean by absolute you know that, floyd fuck absolute right you're playing his game you're playing his game right just say to him okay prove that proof that that bitch god exists right and then we can have a conversation of its attribute right Be but before that now just assume some sort of neutrality i don't have a fucking clue please invite invite me with your knowledge uh mr scambag right and tell me how your god exists put him in the in the in the defensive he's attacking right now and he knows it universal absolute i mean any 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 um, any, any 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 truth is 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 uh is universal and absolute right in so far as it relates no, to god no, no what no 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 any truth wouldn't necessarily be a universal god <laughs> he just okay so one of his minions he says yes only when he, when it he, when he's about to be god and then uh this scumbag uh daft dog is no 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 on his certifications god by definition being a mind who is being a mind prove that bitch yeah oh a god is a mind like if it's like if you are actually um uh, saying any any true value nothing it's claim after claim assertion as as, as the assertion you have got no nothing to back it up oh yes sorry the bible which is circular argument uh, ultimate absolute and the origin of all possibility and impossibility prove it bitch that would be a statement of a no, it's not a statement, it's a claim. Uh, the universal absolute. Now, if you're going to falsify God... You see, falsify God is, is trying to shift the burden of proof by saying, prove they're not God. A uh, deceptive tactic. You're going to have to present the negation of God. So what yeah. is it that is universal and absolute that is not God, that is the ground of all possible... 
No, wrong. You have to define. You have to make. You have to uh, um, empirically prove that there is an absolute. Okay, put that on the table. Show that is the case, and then that is um, uh, put together to a god. So you got you got a bag of claims, right? That you made your shit up in your in your mind, and then you're saying to Floyd. Oh, if that's not the case, prove that it's not the case. Stability that falsifies God. What is that? No, I, I would just show. I would. I would just need to show that 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 specific God. Um, See that? I don't like that like, that language from an atheist. That specific God. It's like mm, yeah, but no, this uh, is is falsified. I don't need to replace it with anything else. No, if God is a, you you understand that by definition, by definition, God would be the uh, designated and defined as being universal, ultimate, and absolute. Who gives a shit, right? It's just you say, saying word salad. Understand that by definition. No, by definition. Yes, by definition, it is God no. being defined as. Yes, by definition, is he's actually is he he's doing a circular argument on on his wording. Yeah, I'm defined. The God is defined by by definition because it, of his existence. Oh, but he exists because we define it. God no, defined the God as God. The Bible is God. No, God. The God. The Bible. 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 The was trying to be polite, edic, uh, and uh, cordial uh, to Dove Dawkins. Uh, he put himself in a pickle, right, and allow him to fucking start um, using the rope on him. The Earth is not I flat agree. with a dome over it. Wait, Floyd, it, Floyd, it, Floyd, by, we're talking about God. By deduction, we know that God doesn't exist. Yeah, okay, so Floyd, you're not following me, okay? So when we talk about the God of the Bible, we're talking about um, the. Is that the Jewish God or the Christian God? God is the creator. It's called the creator creature distinction. I'm sure. Yeah, but that's a name. And I think your your idol, uh, Van Til, invented it. So it's meaningless. It doesn't exist. Sure you're familiar with that? Yes. Okay. Now that's the biblical position. Bullshit. That's Van Til position. Now, in the creator creator distinction, the God of the Bible is ultimate and absolute by definition. Okay, are we clear? No. Okay, in, in the biblical view, God is defined as what is eternal and ultimate. He is the source of all possibility and impossibility, definitionally. Okay, he's a, he's a source of all contingent things. Yeah, see, he's putting more wood, Floyd is putting more wood on the fire. Yeah, of all possibility and impossibility. So he cannot just do what is possible, but what is not impossible, what, what is impossible. That's fucking bollocks. Now, how can you be the source to... of impossibility? He, d he defines what's possible and impossible. <laughs> he defines it. So, um... yeah, because it's the creator creature distinction. Now, this is a no brainer. Uh, yes, it's no brainer because you haven't got a fucking brain. Yeah, this is this is gullibility, indoctrination, uh, stupidity, everything mixed up. So yeah, you are fucking ignorant. Now, in order for you to falsify the God of the Bible, no, you don't need to falsify it. You prove it. Yeah, don't shift the burden of proof, bitch. You're going to need to know what is then, therefore, ultimate and absolute as a negator to the God of the Bible. No, you know that you cannot prove something that. Uh, you made it into your own fucking existence, right? And you're trying to uh, to shift the burden of proof, saying prove it, yeah. And then you put attributes on top of something that it cannot be proven, because you you invented your shit. Being an ultimate and absolute a, not a. How do you falsify a? Is it by instantiating not a Floyd? Yes, but a has to exist. Yeah, a has to be the case, right? If you invent A, you cannot you cannot negate A because it's all up here. Okay? So wrong. No, we look at we look, we look at we look at the uh, claims about that particular God and No. 
about the particular god, no, about the claim of a god. If there's claims no, you're not, of you're, oh, you're not addressing you are. my last question. How do you falsify a? very relevant. Floyd, how do you falsify? See, how you falsify? Always to shift the burden of proof to the other person because uh, we know that this scumbag that I'm talking is a fucking coward. Right, and he cannot prove his God because it doesn't fucking exist in your fucking brain. You just made it up, right? You got a nub, a nubulous, uh, claim, right? And you put you you spewing it out into existence. Phi A is it by presenting not A? Yeah, but but there's there's there's, there's more okay, than just so, there is, okay, just, okay, just, so you know, your guys so are wild. It is different. It's different. See, lawyers are under pressure. Because he has given in into the possibility of uh, um, the definition of a god. That's the problem. Different characteristics. Okay, so when we so when we falsify a, you have to present not a. Is that correct? Yeah, but your a has to be proven. Because I can say a uh, Darth talking is a pedophile, right? Reasonable claim, why? Right? Darth Dawkins is a scumbag, right? Darth Dawkins is Gary Mill, right? That's another claim of mine, okay? I can, I got proof of it, of that uh, that latter statement, right? But you're going to say to me, oh, prove the negative, right? But that case, I can prove the negative, right? Because I got evidence, right? I got written evidence of it, right? From different sources, not just one source, different sources, right? So... And that is factual. That, that that A is real. Your A, your God, is imaginary, right? Because you have not, uh, uh, have, you have not risen to the level of positive claim, because you are a coward. I, I need present not A. Floyd, this is not yeah. complicated. You're, you're yeah, honest. Yeah, so I can, I can present not A. Cause, okay, okay cause now the God of the Bible is defined as a God that created a flat earth. Uh, okay. 6,000 years ago, no. with a solid there are no, over it. Since, like, there are that, no, since that doesn't exist, we, we have not A. There are no, could you show me any field, professional theologian who says the Bible teaches a flat earth? Yes, there are. Right, and that's the reason of my of my previous video. Right, he's gonna uh, Floyd. Okay, let me let me let me show you that he mentioned the person. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm Michael Heiser. Michael Heiser. Okay, so I did research for a week about this idiot, uh, Michael Heiser, that he's already dead. Right, and he, uh, Michael Heiser, is a theologian, right, uh, of ancient religious studies, especially Hebrew. Right, or the thieves, what they call it, the Old Testament, right? And in the in the previous video, I'm showing a clip, right, whereby he's saying that the writers at that time acknowledge. He's actually saying in the video, he is acknowledging, right, that the people at that day, at that time, thought that there was fucking four pillars, uh, holding the uh, the base. Or of the circle of the flat earth system, right? He also goes and shows a flat earth graphic, right? And shows the different, the three levels, the heavens, the, the, the fucking dome, the, uh, and, and, and the earth and the waters uh, above and, and underneath, all that fucking flat earth bullshit, right? This guy, theologian, is saying that the people at that time thought it was that the case so yes you have been proven wrong bitch and i'm proving it because a theological theologian is saying it right so they're talking fuck you uh university of Pennsylvania. okay can you can you can you he's a theologian he, he, he's a bible scholar yeah you guys were uh, you christians uh, mainly the dishonest one check that video right i, uh, I will put the link on, on this video's description, right? Whereby he's actually saying that. So therefore they're banking Darth Dawkins, there and then. Yes, so yes. Okay, can you can you provide me with a link where he says 
Uh, as a Bible scholar, the Bible teaches a flat earth because I've been studying sure. the Bible for 40 years. I've never talked with any other uh, a true Christian who believes the Bible. And now he has to um, uh, put a little bit of a dis uh, dishonesty here. He says, oh, the true Christian never would think that. Idiot. It's not about a fucking Christian, right? It was the time of the Jews, right? The Bible was not written uh, in the New Testament era. You ignorant sod, right? The whole idea of that uh, um, uh, religious uh, uh, Judaism, right, is that the story was made by them, right, and then carry on onto the New Testament, right, and the New Testament writers just sugarcoated a little bit the bullshit of the of the Hebrew Bible. That's it, right, and the Hebrew Bible says it was a flat Earth. Only in the fifteen hundreds or so they start changing their their mind. Oh, yeah, it's starting to change the mind. Bible teaches that it's a flat earth. Oh, oh sure, just go on YouTube. I, I, yeah, just go now, on YouTube. Now, now well, for, well, first... See, now he changes his mind because he doesn't want to check it. He's that, he's that much of a fucking coward. He's, no, 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 no. I want to carry on um, giving bullshit uh, to Floyd. Yeah, because that's my speciality. I don't want to be corrected. You fucking loser, coward. Well, first of all, are right. all are all are all conclusions? Who who else is talking? Right, this is the second part of, of my video, so I'm going to take this bullshit about defining his God into existence. Right, um, let me get rid of this. Yep, and bring up my text. Okay, so let's follow what this idiot scumbag is saying here. Hey, Floyd, are all conclusions... So I, so I presented it as not A, so therefore I falsified Floyd, Floyd, Floyd are, all, are all empirical conclusions provisional? Right. That talk is already fucked up here. Are all empirical, all empirical conclusions provisional? No. No, they're not. Right? So I'm just going to put a couple of... Uh, yeah, you can see my... Yeah, you can see it. So... Let's define, I got uh, empirical conclusions and provisionals, yeah? So I've got empiricals here, the conclu what is conclusion and what is provisional, right? So the te so we're gonna define this. So the term empirical basically means that it is guided by, guided by scientific experiences and or evidence. So when he says empirical, we're talking about evidence, okay? Likewise, a study of empirical, when it is using real world evidence, in investigating its assertions. So when it says, okay, is this is this made out of a uh, foam? Has this got black has this got black lines? So we're just gonna examine it if this has got black lines, what is the texture of it, blah 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 blah. We use empirical evidence, right? So we're gonna establish that. So these are all empiricals, right? So what is a conclusion? Yeah. The uh, term conclusion means that at the end or finish of an event. Right, process or text, the conclusion of a text. The term provisional, right, is something that it has been arranged or appointed for the present, but may be changed in the future, right? Provisional, I understand that, right? But the problem is or, and his position of or, that's why he fucked up, right? So now I'm putting provisional conclusion, yeah? Provisional conclusion. A subject to later alteration, tem temporary or conditional, right? Which I'm okay with those terms, right? But the question is, are all empirical? Everything that has been tested, is it provisional? No, right? And uh, my scientific... I've got something here. Right, so yeah. So let's put it up, up to, up to there, right? So I argue, right, that the use of the word "all" in the in in the question are all empirical conclusions provisional, right? Which is that, right? Is overly broad or misleading? It is fucking misleading from this scumbag Daft Orchids, right? It implies that every single empirical conclusion, without exception. Right, without exception, that's a that's a clause of being all, right? Is pro, is provisional, which may not necessarily be the case. And I I'm, I'm going to give you an example, 
right? In the context of everyday observation and well-established, and this is the important part, well-established phenomena, and I'm giving an example, such as the functioning of a light switch, okay? That's an empirical evidence of a, of a singular item, right? We can often consider the conclusion to be reliable and non-provisional. End of the discussion. You, Dove Dawkins, you've been fucking defeated again, right? Because it all, it's all empirical. No, yeah? Because the common observation, right, of something that's been studied, like a light, like a, the ball, yeah, it's not subject to revision. That's your problem. Right? So when it when it comes to a practical application and commonly observed phenomena, we have a high degree of confidence that in the that in the outcomes base uh, of repeated uh, uh, consistent experiences. So basically, you switch the light on and off, on and off, on and off all the fucking time. It is reliable, right? It's non-provisional because it's not subject to change. The only time an individual would need to change, not scientific people. The, the the user is to either has broken down or it wants to uh, change the, the the type of lighting the, the 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 casing the button is broken or whatever right but it's not subject to revision it's subject to repair sure right but not to change it's not provisional that is already well established well well established right so uh, you Dr. Docker you've been debunked in that bullshit as well Right, so empirical conclusions in everyday life, often based on what we refer to as common sense, light switch is a common sense, or practical knowledge, which is derived from the from our direct observational experiences, right? What we see. Okay, so the conclusions are not typically sub the conclusions are not typically subject to the same level of scrutiny and revision as scientific theories uh, in the fringes of, of knowledge. So this is only when Dove Dawkins may have a case, right? But be, this scumbag has to be, be dishonest. And instead of saying uh, uh, that it's provisional in the, uh, in the fringes of our understanding uh, from the scientific world, right? Let's say you send a probe to fucking Jupiter or whatever. Yeah, you haven't got a fucking clue how to land, how this or that, or the, uh, how dense is the surface area, the ground pressure or whatever, to see if anything can land there. Yeah, so the uh, the information is provisional, right? It, it, it will be subject to change. But when you establish everything, when it's all uh, uh, well uh, scrutinized, tests and whatever, then you, it's non-provisional. Then you can, you can, you can do things Right and be, and get reliable outcomes. So, well, it is reliable. Uh, sorry, reasonable to consider everyday empirical conclusion as reliable in most cases. Of course, it is still valuable to maintain a degree uh, a degree of openness to alternative explanation. To be aware that the exception can exist for sure. Right, but the light switch is a generic thing that doesn't need to change because it serves a particular function. Right, in any, in any, the the the, uh, the, um, the contact of the mobile things, right? Uh, the switch of, of my light, this one here, right? This one here, right? It serves its purpose, right? It is non-provisional, it is not subject to change. It's fixed. If this thing breaks, it goes to the fucking bin. If I buy a new one, <laughs> it will have the same characteristics, right? So anyway. Let's go on. Scientific inquiry is uh, inquiry, and the provisional nature of conclusion primarily come into when, when we venture into the frontiers uh, frontiers of knowledge. Which is, that's what I was saying about the fringes, right? Exploring phenomena that are less understood or subject to ongoing investigation. Totally cool with that, right? So, is your knowledge of God provisional? Now, this is what uh, Dr. Uh, what uh, Floyd XP asked for him, right? So, let's carry on with it with this idiot. So this is the second time I debunked that idiot, Daft Dawkins. Uh, so let's carry on. Uh, they're, they're limited to our... Okay, Floyd, experience. are all empirical conclusions provisional? Okay, yeah. so you're using a provisional conclusion to falsify the God of the Bible? Well, uh, well... 
You see, he's using a scientific fringe, right, to say you cannot prove my God because the scientific people have got no empirical evidence of proving something that uh, Daft Talk is, make, is making up. That's basically what, what this idiot is saying. Uh, your Bible is, is a progressive revelation. Floyd, are you using a provisional conclusion to falsify the God of the Bible? Yeah, I'm fallible. That's all I have. That's all I have. Okay. Okay. So probable then. Then it doesn't. Uh, it, then it doesn't necessitate the falsity of the God of the Bible because. It See, God of the Bible, you haven't proven that your God of the Bible exists. Provision. So, are you using a provisional conclusion? Or, or, or you, you have, please don't over talk me. No, no. You have please a provisional view of, of your please interpretation do not over of God. No, 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 no. See, I think Floyd already realized uh, what Darth Talk is trying to push Floyd into. He's trying to put it into a corner where he has to use empirical evidence to demonstrate the negation of a God. That's fucked up. That's really fucked up. I'm talking. Don't over talk me. Floyd, no, please do not over talk me. Boy. Floyd, listen, please boy. do not. No, listen, don't over talk me, boy. Yeah. Boy, okay, so, quiet, quiet. Yeah, see, see, you're playing right into my game. Oh, you're playing into your game. Yes. Yes, you, you, because your fucking life is a fucking game, idiot. No, no I'm, I'm not. I don't listen to you. I'm not your bitch. As 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 I predicted, this is what the tactic that you would employ no. on question. No. What tactic, idiot? What tactic? Are all empirical conclusion provisional? No, right? You are a scumbag, Daft Hawkins. You've been proven wrong, right? And you're still bitching about fucking uh, uh, Floyd SP uh, about not being able to prove your imaginary friend. How much of a scumbag can you be? Now, I'd like to know the following question. No, you uh, no you're the answer, you're the answer to my question. You understand? Uh, you, you address uh, me as uh, sir uh, when you talk to me. Now, understand? Now, do you see the tag? Are you, you going to address me as sir? Are you going to address okay. me as sir, does that, boy? Does, every, does everybody see the tactic? By the way, I'm recording this. You are recording that. You know, you know, you're lying, bitch. Somebody else recorded. You are lying scumbag, right? That's a fat thing that you fucked up today, right? You got two YouTube channels. Right, and you got zero fucking content, right? I mean, you could record, you could be recording into your own uh, um, laptop, Apple laptop, fucking shitty Apple laptop, right? But that is as far as it goes. So you may give it to one of your bitches, uh, uh, minions, right, to do something about it. But to actually for you to put it into YouTube, that's a lie. I don't give a shit. Turn. I know you don't. Now, now, are you now is, your knowledge, is your knowledge of God provisional to your limited fallible? Hey, this is the question. Is your knowledge of God provisional? Why? Uh, no. Nature. Yes or no? No. <laughs> no. That's the dishonesty kicking in. No, I could not be wrong. Right? So this is, then, then I put this on. Right? So then, uh, the after all kids, you wouldn't have any excuse proving it. So if it's not provisional, it means it's actually factual. Right? It is the case. Right? And your your empirical evidence, what is it? Oh, the Bible said so. Pure circular, begging the question, right? And everything. You know what? You are a, are a, uh, a fallacy master, uh, Daft Hawkins. But anyway, let's carry on. Oh, 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 now, oh, so now, you're, now, so now, now I answered your question. I answered your question. Now, are you using any? Are you using a, a provisional conclusion to falsify? I already, uh, I already answered that. I already is answered it, that. Well, is it a yes? Yes, I, I said we're all okay. limited, so everything's provisional until further okay. information so, comes so, out. So that technically is incorrect. Okay. Uh, my uh, spoon is not provisional. It won't change. Okay, the common things that science has made is non-provisional. That's the problem. But I understand, I, I respect Floyd and that he's been put into pressure. Yeah, I am replying in hindsight, which is unfair, right? But uh, everything considered, he defended himself very well against this fucking scumbag. The provisional conclusion is not necessarily true then? 
the, 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 sometime in the future, if some some new knowledge comes about, then that would that would change. Is my your view. provisional conclusion that you're using to falsify the God of the Bible is shifting the better on the proof? That's another policy. Is it necessarily true, or could it possibly be false? It could be possibly false with new information. So, so you haven't falsified the God of the Bible. But you haven't proven uh, to be the case either, bitch. You haven't proven A for for Floyd not to prove not A. So you, Duff Talk, is a fucked up first. Okay? I will then. Well, you know, with our current information about that, yes, we have. And our current no, knowledge. no. If it's, if it's provisional, it's not necessarily true then, correct? <laughs> it's provisional. You idiot. It's unnecessarily true that that the Bible's correct about about uh, the creator. Okay. Of the well, well, you're you're again you're shifting the goalpost now. No, your provisional no, conclusion. Not. No, he's not shifting the goalpost. Yeah, he's using your own Bible to debunk your bullshit claim of a god, which is okay. It's it's okay. Yeah, but he's being honest. In the Bible says that your imaginary friend made the fucking uh, the whole thing in six days, right? That's empirically impossible, right? We can demonstrate that, right? And uh, Floyd uh, X, uh, FP is doing that, using that empirical evidence, using the Bible against you, bitch. Is your provisional, con does, does your falsification, when you falsify the God of the Bible, is the falsification? You know, it's, you're trying to falsify a, a claim, a, a unproven claim, which is deceptive. And the God of the Bible necessarily true that the God of the Bible is false. Necessarily true. That's uh, meta. That's irrelevant. He's he's fucking uh, doing well salad as usual. False. It would be necessarily true based based on my current knowledge. Yes. Okay. No, I ask you: Is your falsification of the God of the Bible necessarily true? Mm -hmm. Based based on uh, my current knowledge and assumptions, yeah. Yeah, you're repeating the same thing that you had. Why do you think I asked the question again? No, you, no you're, you're, you're asking me to step outside talk my me. worldview. Please, please don't. No, no I'm, I'm answering your question. Please you're, you're, don't over talk me. No, no. Please don't over talk me. I'm trying to be a bully motherfucker, a scumbag. Yeah? that I, I live in my mother's basement, a 62, 61 fucking year old grown up fucking man child. Yeah, that he's worried that he's been overtalked. Please don't overtalk me, fucking child. No, you're over talking me. Over -talk me. Yeah, yeah, please don't overtalk me. Actually, actually, I was talking when you cut me off, Lloyd. No, actually, you been you were you were being a scumbag. No, this you cut a, me off. This is a Floyd. This is a tactic that you have employed. No, you are the tactic. You are using Vantillion. Uh, bullshit presuppositional pre bullshit. Many times, no, especially on Google. I'm, Plus. I'm aware of your do you recall when you do you recall when you did that on Google Plus several times? No, right? no, I don't. I recall you being very. Okay, rude you don't. You don't. Right. 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 Well, like we had. I have. I actually have the recordings. Idiot, scumbag. I do have the recording uh, as well. And you were the negligent one. You you were the asshole uh, in this game, right? Because you're being argumentative, bitch. Right, trying to be the fucking alpha dog without proving your case. Right? You are weak. You are weak. You're using your fucking red button when you control it, right, to to trying to uh, uh, bully people into fucking submission. That doesn't make you right. It makes you scumbag. That's it. Simple as that. Of you cutting me off on Google Plus. Now, uh, I, I, have, I, have I, have, I have like three recordings your, on, my, on my YouTube. Is your... Daft Talkings, Gary. Why the fuck are you interrupting? Why are you over talking? You moan about people over talking you and you over talk other people, right? Why do you have to be so fucking dishonest, right? You listen, you could be an excellent, excellent Padawan for the, for the devil. You excellent. You will shine. You will get a fucking Oscar for the best a bullshitter in this fucking planet, probably in the fucking universe. Yeah, aliens would be jealous of your bullshit. Or is your, I know you did, okay, because you're shameless. Now, mm -hmm. um, is your knowledge that you use to falsify the God of the Bible, is your knowledge base? Shifted the burden of proof. Necessarily true. 
Uh, yes, if it is knowledge, it's necessarily true, yes. Your, your knowledge is necessarily true? Yes. Okay, so what is it that you... You see, it's not... It's, the question was all empirical conclusions. Not what, not what uh, Floyd thinks. All empirical, right? So he's, he's focusing on uh, Floyd instead of the of the actual original question. You believe that is necessarily true, and, and he mentioned he put uh, he put the extra caveat of being necessary. Yeah, it's been it's, it's a deceiver. Cannot be false. No, he asked me if my knowledge was necessarily true. Yes, all knowledge no, you, is necessarily true. You're, you're, cha oh, you're changing the subject. No, no, you're no, changing I'm, the subject. <laughs> it's come back. You're changing the subject, yeah? Which the original question are uh, or empirical conclusion of original, yeah? And, he, and he's accusing Floyd of changing the question. What a fucking scam bag. No, so I'm answering your question. Not, no, no, you're not. You're responding. Yes, I am. Me. You asked me. You're being it, argumentative. No, 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 no. You asked me. It might, I, no, I just want no. you to understand that I'm recording this, Floyd. I'm recording it, bitch. I'm going to be here for fucking ever. Right? I'm recording this, bitch. I, yeah. You said that several this, times. This, that, you that, asked me. You, you asked me if my knowledge was necessarily true, yeah. and I answered yes. Correct. Duff uh, talking things that record him recorded or allegedly recorded because we know he's a lying bitch, right? He thinks that re him recording something, it, it will carry any weight. He's Duff talking. You're a fucking loser. So what? Yeah, that's that. Does it make your recording, your comments true? No. It's just saying that you, you're a fucking loser. Is that what, correct? What do, you, no. what, do you, what do you know that's necessarily true? I'm going to ask you again. You asked me if my knowledge was necessarily true. Is that correct? Did you need me, did you need me to repeat the question? Just say yes or no. I, I'm, I'm, I'm me, asking. Or do, you want to, or do you want to do your little shtick being argumentative to, to avoid I'm, Argumentative. Argumentative is in your nature, uh, Gary. Right? You ooze being argumentative. You're trying to be a a alpha dog bitch. You're a female bitch. Oh, no. You're, you're being Sorry. rude. You're being rude. No, no. actually, actually, no, no, really right? lady, patient. No, no, no. If oh, poor sod. Gary Mill. He's losing his patience. Floyd, don't be so fucking rude to, to Gary Mill. Please. You're going to hurt his fucking feelings. Whatever the fuck that means. If, if I have knowledge, is that knowledge necessarily true? Yes or no? Okay. Answer the question. I don't, I don't believe, I don't believe from your frame of reference, you can instantiate that knowledge is possible. Now, Floyd, oh, now he's doing his uh, presuppositional pre presupposition bullshit. Right now, he's trying to say that uh, his worldview is incoherent. N now we know that he's jumping uh, further back, further back into the into the script, or further down, shall we say? Floyd, if I have Floyd, knowledge, Floyd, 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 I was speaking. Correct. Floyd, I was speaking. If, if I have knowledge, is it necessarily Floyd, true? Please, yes do no. not, please do not. Please do not overspeak. No, no, you answer my question. Flo I just did answer your question. If I, no, you did. Answer, answer, answer it again. If I have knowledge, is it necessarily true? Yes or no? I don't believe that that if is a possibility in your frame of reference. Now that's the second time I've had. You see, he's using presuppositional apologetics. Right now, he says. Because he cannot answer, or he's dishonestly trying to not answer Floyd's question. He's trying to say, you cannot say, Floyd, you cannot say if. It's impossible. right? You, Floyd, don't talk. Yeah, don't talk. right? Whatever you say is incoherent. It's intelli unintelligible. Well, that's your view, and I disagree. Because no, no, in my world view, I, I can have knowledge. I agree. In your world view, I don't see how you can have knowledge okay, at all. No, no. Your now, mm -hmm. can you tell me, is there anything that you believe that is necessarily true in your world? Oh, yes. All, all, all the things I believe are knowledge are, would be necessarily true. No, that's not an answer to the question. That was Yeah, it's idea. based on my worldview, right? No, Floyd, you're not answering the question. Yeah, no, I... I... Uh, this is the same as, as Dr. Oki answer a question. Instead of, instead of responding to the question, 
it's actually far better to say, oh, uh, Gary, uh, what do you want me to answer? So you feel fucking good and you can go the next tick on the, on your fucking uh, script list. Yeah, that that's basically what you want. Yeah, to to answer correctly the questions that you want to answer in a particular way. A scam bag. No, uh, you're asking me to um, make uh, conclusions in reasoning uh, without accepting my metaphysical assumptions. Floyd, you didn't answer the question. Which, which, which would not be possible. Correct. That's a, that's an honest response. Floyd, you didn't answer the question. You yes, just I did. And Dove Tokens, like, for example, uh, uh, um, uh, Jill, right, in his response, is not listening. Right? Dove Tokens, you are the one not listening. Yeah, I did answer the question. Wait, Floyd, is there any belief that you have that is necessarily true? Yes. What is that? Yeah, th those, those. Any belief that is necessarily true, when it's true, it's not just a belief, it's actually knowledge or justified true belief. Uh, that are actual knowledge. No, I'm asking you to be specific. What singular belief that you have in any? What singular belief? Uh, one singular belief that you're a scumbag. There you are. That's one single belief. It's actually factual. At all, it's necessarily true and cannot possibly be false. Oh, that, that you're a scumbag. That you're a bully piece of shit. It cannot be, it cannot be not true. Right? Easy. You're a bully. You're a loser. Oh, well, I'm sitting in a chair right now. Okay, why can that not be false? Really? Really? Oh, because because uh, it's a uh, it's a it's a reliably uh, true belief. No, what you're just you're repeating the same claim. Scambag, Darth Dawkins. Lloyd is saying that he's got his ass in a chair. That he's talking to you while he's sitting in a chair. What part of your midget mind you don't fucking get? You are trying to be what what you are saying to other people. You're trying to be argumentative, right? You're trying to uh, create a fight, right? You are the fucking definition of a bully, right? Lucky, lucky, you are lucky that I'm not near you, right? Because I will teach you a lesson of what is to be a bully, idiot. In, this, in different words, how is that belief necessarily true and that it cannot possibly be false? Um, any 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 knowledge uh, belief is necessarily true. I already... justify a true belief. Correct. That's knowledge. Explain that to you. No, I'm. I'm you're not. Again, you're not. You're just. You just. Scumbag. You just said to him to prove a true a, a a true belief. He said he's sitting down. Simple. You fucked up again. Just being verbose, you're truly not answering the question. I, I am answering belief, How is that belief that you're sitting in a chair that it can't possibly be false? Based on my worldview, right? Okay, what is your worldview? Did you, does your worldview have an ultimacy that institutes what's possible? And not possible. Impossible? Yeah, sure. Yes, of course. What? What is that? Oh, that, that would that would be the reality we live in. No, okay, so what you're saying, so what? See now, now he's segueing. When you say, see, this is so because he he lost. He, uh, Duff talking knows he lost about uh, Floyd F, um, FP saying that he's got his ass in a chair. Right? He ca he cannot defend the negative. A common mistake that unbelievers make. Uh, no, um, no, the mistake you're making may, is, may I and, and, and the double standard. Please, I wasn't, I wasn't right, finished. Right, right. Okay? I wasn't I agree. finished. Please don't overtalk me. No, now, you, you please don't interrupt now, me. When you say, when, hmm. well, actually, I haven't been. I've been actually quite uh, respectful. And bullshit. Absolute fucking bullshit. Right? You've been nothing but a scumbag. No, no, you're not respectful at all. No, now, I agree. Floyd, when you say that reality is the ultimacy of reality, the ultimacy of what institutes what's possible and impossible, when you say reality, is that is that a is that a concrete one or an abstract one? 
There you go. There he goes again with the concrete bullshit. It, it, it has. It had both, in my own view. There's, abs- there's no, abstract reality, things. Reality, there's, there's, there's concrete reality, things and, there, and there's right, abstract is, things. Is, is, is when you say reality, is reality a concrete one where there are not actual discrete particulars? Or is reality a... Concrete is just a definition. Idiot. You're trying you try to make it uh, like if it's a thing, right? What a dishonest piece of shit. A, 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 a collection of concrete particulars. Well, we seem to experience both. No, I'm asking you when you say reality, see, that answer, either it was evasive or you truly didn't understand the simple question. When you say no, reality you're, is you're, ultimate, you're, 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 I'm you're speaking, you're, you're, over ta- you're over-talking me again. Please do no, not no, no, no. Please do not over-talk me, Floyd, okay? Now, when you say, when I, when you say, that your worldview is what what dictates what's possible. And I say, what is it that's ultimate? And you say reality, right? What I want to know is when you use the word reality, does that refer to something that reality is just one thing or is... No, you re- reality is everything that comp- com- composes in the universe. Me, you, a scumbag or anything else. We consider that as real. That's it. Don't don't give fucking uh, mumbo jumbo world salad. Reality, a set of particulars. Well, we, we seem to have a phenomenon of both. We have some other problem with the one. No, you're not. You're not. You're not, un, you're not understanding here. Okay. No, no, reality. Either either, either reality is it. Do you know the difference between concrete and abstract? Yeah, a, a concrete. A, and actually, a, an abstract. Is is a uh, frame of mind. You can say um, you can you can imagine different things and be uh, abstract about it, right? But it's nothing to do with fucking reality, right? It's two fucking different things. Okay. It's like reality, thing. reality. Yeah. If it it's if the reality abstraction is, is like reality and stuff. And so, hey, Floyd, Floyd, yeah. Floyd, listen. No, you're, you're, you're interrupting me. By, yeah. No, no, you're interrupting. Yeah, Floyd, why are you so agitated? Because you're interrupting me. No, the whole co- time I've been speaking with you, you've been quite on edge. Well, well no, no, no. I- well, if you've been a, if you were not being a scumbag, polite, or being polite, uh, he would not be able to uh, be this feel this way, because because you are a scumbag, right? And you've been argumentative. Right, it's not. It's reasonable for Floyd to uh, to raise his tem- temper, right? Because you're not being fair, you're not being honest, you're not being transparent. Uh, yeah, you're trying to follow your own fucking presupposition of script, right? And I think uh, this goes for another forty or odd minutes, but I don't. I don't think I want to carry on here. My main focus here on this video, it was about uh, Michael's uh, thing about uh, the flat Earth. Right, which I'm debunking this piece of shit, uh, Darth Dawkins, Gary Mill, and also the empirical uh, side of it, right? And uh, we know that Darth Dawkins was losing on every single stage, right? And he was trying to uh, take Floyd to the fucking uh, uh, rabbit trail, right? Further down, further down, further down to his script, which we have se- we have heard it to nauseam, right? So I'm going to end this video here, right? Um, and I hope you guys. Uh, that you like it. Uh, I loved uh, to debunk this piece of shit uh, human being. Right? I actually quite enjoyed it. Right? I'm, I, I, I have fun uh, when uh, Darth Talk in the bank um, helps me with information with with the weapons right of uh, of Darth Talking's own fuck up uh, commentary when he contradicts himself. Right? It's very very nice. Right? To uh, see that this guy is a fucking loser old man is a loser or man child right so anyway without any without that um i thank you for everybody yeah and until the next time i hope the other one is next week yeah but as i said i cannot promise anything till next time and dove talkings go and fuck yourself